Defects in plastering Blistering of plastered surface Blistering is the formation of small patches of plaster swelling out beyond the plastered surface, arising out of late slaking of lime particles in the plaster. Cracking Cracking is the development of one or more fissures in the plaster surface is known as cracking. Causes of cracking Formation of cracks or fissures in the plaster work resulting from the following reasons colon. Imperfect preparation of background. Structural defects in building. Discontinuity of surface. Movements in the background due to its thermal expansion or rapid drying. Movements in the plaster surface itself, either due to expansion or shrinkage. Excessive shrinkage due to application of thick coat. Faulty workmanship. Efflorescence. It is the whitish crystalline substance, appears on the surface due to presence of salts in plaster making materials. This gives a very bad appearance. It affects the adhesion of paint with wall surface. Efflorescence can be removed to some extent by dry bushing and washing the surface repeatedly. Falling off. Flaking. It is the formation of very loose mass of plastered surface, due to poor bond between successive coats. Peeling. It is the complete dislocation of some portion of plastered surface, resulting in the formation of a patch. This also results from imperfect bond. Popping. It is the formation of conical hole in the plastered surface due to presence of some particles which expand on setting. Rust stains, formed when plaster is applied on metal laths. Uneven surface, this is obtained purely due to poor workmanship. Crazing. Cracking is the phenomenon that is fine cracks on the surface. The cement paste which is exposed to drying condition crack easily and resulting in crazing. The cracks appear in a crazy pattern generally 6 mm to 75 mm in length. It observed during the rainy season when the wet surface starts drying. However, it reduces the durability of the concrete structure. It appears after 1 to 7 days period or much later. Drying shrinkage. Drying shrinkage occurs when water starts evaporating from the exposed surface. The moisture differential along the depth of the slab causes strain which induces tensile stresses. The loss of water causes a decrease in volume and constant drying shrinkage.